What is up and welcome to Maps on the Map. So in today's video we're back at Hotel Eskara Arte, a newly opened, adults only, all fun inclusive resort in Cancun, Mexico. Now one of my favourite things about any hotel is breakfast. So today we're going to be getting our munch on at Mercado San Juan, which is the buffet restaurant serving breakfast, lunch and dinner on the daily. Now the vibes of this place are on point. It's just incredible stepping into this place, let alone eating here. You feel like you're at a Mexican carnival with various stands showcasing the different flavours of Mexico. Now the food here is on another level and it's all freshly prepared and packed full of flavour. But before we get into the breakfast review, let's take a look at some of the mouth-watering eats. Anything you could dream of is served at this breakfast buffet and what sets this apart from other hotel breakfasts is the presentation. Starting with drinks, there's fresh orange juice and a huge selection of smoothies. If you want a more standard breakfast, they have an omelette station and do your breakfast classics like sausages, bacon, bagels, scrambled eggs. Now there's also the biggest selection of fresh seafood, cold cut meats and cheeses that I've seen. And as for fruit, you want it, they got it and it all tastes so fresh. Now if like me, you're feeling a little bit adventurous, the Mexican dishes here are a must try. There's a whole station dedicated to things like tacos and quesadillas, and you can help yourself to loads of different salsas, some of which are bare spicy. There's also soups, vegetables, rice, pork, chicken, and even a Mexican barbecue, which is just banging. And oh my days, nachos in Mexico hit different. There's something about their guacamole and salsa which you just don't get back home. Now, you know you gotta let loose a little when you're on holiday, so let's talk about my favourite section, the sweet section. They do the most amazing selection of pastries with classics like pan au chocolat and croissants, but also some unique Mexican pastries too. There's also freshly made crepes, waffles, and the most incredible warm donuts and churros. And if you want ice cream for breakfast, then knock yourself out. They got vegans covered too, sort of. But enough of showing you these amazing foods, let's try some of this food. Okay, so we're at Mercado de San Juan, and this is the first plate. So what we've gone for is we've gone for a chicken quesadilla, we've gone for some kind of nachos with some guacamole and salsa, and also some, some pork which they prepare fresh. So first let's give the nacho with the guacamole and salsa a go. There you go, there you can see. You got some fresh salsa with some onions, some tomatoes, some coriander and then fresh guacamole. Let's give it a go. It's so fresh. These are so crispy. Okay, so what you're hearing here is a man with a basket of pastries on his head and a clown horn going ha, ha, ha. It's legit, like you're at a market. And the salsa and guacamole is so fresh, you get that kick of lime, that kick of coriander. Here in Mexico they use loads of coriander in all their food. It's so good. Next one we're going to try is the pork. Let's give it a taste. That is really good. It really melts in your mouth, it's very smooth. It's got a nice like barbecue flavour to it. Banging pork. And then finally, we're going to try the quesadilla. And what we've gone for is a chicken quesadilla with cheese inside it uh, and they've put some guacamole in there and they've put this green kind of habanero sauce and some red sauce on there as well. Let's get a bit of everything. Yeah, let's give it a go. That is really good. These are fresh tortillas. The chefs make them, you can see them making them. And then it all just tastes really fresh, really good. The cheese is nice and strong. There's a bit of a kick from the sauces. It's just a perfect combination. So that's plate number one. Okay, so for plate number two, or well, round number two, I thought I'd keep it Mexican. So what I've gone for here is basically a Mexican hot chocolate. On the sign it said chocolate with water. So I assume that is hot chocolate. So let's give this a taste. Oh, that's really nice. So it's basically like 
a nice rich hot chocolate but like with a cinnamon like kick to it that's really nice okay so that's that's a winner that's a winner right there and then these are tamales it's basically like a field wet tortilla and it's kind of wrapped in this leaf and then they open it up and they give it to you so we went for one sweet one and one savory one so i think this one here is pineapple and this one here is pork let's open this this is the pork one and that is what it looks like it's pork and beans so let's give this a taste it's nice it's very dense so you probably need some sauce with it she did offer sauce with it um, but then i just wanted to try it in its kind of purest form but it's good so you probably do need some sauce with that and then let's break into the pineapple one there you go so i'm hoping this would be more like a dessert tamale or more... <laughs> i'm hoping this would be more of a dessert tamale or more of a sweet one so let's give that a go it's definitely sweet though that's nice that is if you whack a bit of chocolate sauce on that, you're on to a winner. So that, it tastes very different. This is a lot sweeter. So this is a really nice, I really like the pineapple one actually. So that's plate number two. After this, we're gonna go on to the dessert round because I am getting full. But we'll show you what we got for dessert in a bit. Now for the final and best round, we've gone for the sweet round. Here's what we've got for today. We've gone for a churro, a cinnamon roll, this thing I don't really know what it is uh, and we've gone for a chocolate donut with kind of peanuts or hazelnuts on top and that looks absolutely banging. First let's go for the cinnamon roll, okay let's give this a go. There you go. That's what it looks like on the inside and it's really fresh really crispy that is delicious next we've got this thing i don't really know what it is i think it's like a jam filled pastry it looks really interesting so let's give this a bite Whoa. it is a jam filled pastry but i don't know what flavor it is but it's really really nice the pastries here are so good Next we go for this monster. This is the churro. And the best churros that I've ever had are in Mexico. You don't get churros like these back in England. These are wicked. It is so crispy on the outside. And it's glazed with cinnamon sugar. And then really soft and doughy on the inside. These are my favorite. And then finally, they do donuts throughout the day. This restaurant turns into breakfast, lunch and dinner and they always do freshly made donuts. And they've got several different kind of flavors. Sometimes they have white chocolate, dark chocolate, just normal cinnamon sugar donuts. So let's give this a go. That is so good, man. Look at that. Look at that aeration. Proper soft dough. Crispy hour. Melted chocolate on top and peanuts. Probably put on a lot of weight this holiday. But it was worth it. This food is banging. So the pastry chef has given Mance on the map a bonus round. He just came and gave me these things. I don't really know what they are. It's like some sort of dough ball. Maybe it's a donut ball. I don't know. But it looks good and we're gonna give it a go. So for those of you in the comments that know what this is, please do let me know. Oh, the warm. There you can see. It's really soft, you can see me squeezing it. It's got sugar on top. Whoa, it's filled. So it's filled with like custard, or like caramel custard. So that concludes breakfast. Here at Hotel Escort Arte. Till next time, peace. Till next time, peace.